For the Generations project, the youth group gave everyone in the youth $10 to invest in some way. Um, Alan gave every member in the youth $10 since most of us don't have jobs or um, a continuous income. I took my $10 and made a bunch of CDs that I sold at school for $5 each. And the CDs had music that um, I had composed, written, and um, edited, produced to put on YouTube. Oh, my YouTube channel, Whole Power 5. You could have like blinking things on the screen. <laughs> ding, ding. It's Christian hip hop music. Yo, oh, James, the servant of the Lord, he's my mother. Well, technically, because we had the same mother. Not quite sure about the science, because he was walking the water, got wine for the water, was selling them all to get with the father. If you could see my face when, he broke at the. <laughs> All people don't like hip hop. We invested $10, and my Sunday school class put our $10 together, and we made cake balls, which we sold at school. A cake ball is basically cake crumbled up, and then you uh, stir in a can of icing, and then you form little balls, and you put it in the fridge, and you take it out later and um, put some melting chocolate on it. So it's cake and icing and every bite. I should have brought some cake balls and be like, I have a little home studio um, with equipment that I picked up as time has gone on. I started over the summer just writing stuff with my brothers. I've always been really interested in hip hop and um, using that in a way to glorify Jesus Christ. It's um, really important to me. My life group got together at um, one of our house and um, we just had a huge cake ball making party. It was like five hours long and uh, both times we made like 200 something cake balls. And it was just a lot of fun and a really good bonding experience for our life group. I've sold quite a few at my, um, at my school to friends, uh, even to some uh, of the staff at my school, and I've raised approximately $250 as of now. Selling the cake balls for a dollar a piece, we made $439 together.